I mean, uh, it, it just kind of gets us fired up, just uh, him going out there and be able to take licks and just get up and uh, be, be ready to go again. I mean, uh, that's just really motivating for you. Uh, you have a quarterback ready to go out there and just uh, lay it all on line for you uh, as, we, as, uh, as we are for him. So, I mean, it's just really great. Uh, it's going to be very awesome. I mean, I didn't even know that. Didn't even know that. But it's going to be crazy. But I just hope our our dome experience are, t are two totally different outcomes. You know, uh, he got there. He kind of took an L. But I mean, he had a great game. But I just want to be able to go in the dome and just kind of rectify his loss as well and just come out there with a the victory. And I mean, that that'd be great. Uh, uh, for me, it's just mind blowing. Just, uh, j j just being able, just growing up with him, and uh, now I'm seeing him becoming to his own man. J j j just him becoming to his own self. Uh, I mean, he definitely has the talents and the ability to be better and be a better back than I ever was. I mean, just, uh, just getting to a game uh, this past season and seeing what he does. I mean, it was just really crazy to think that he's a sophomore out there, uh, unfortunately doing those things. And I mean, it was just really mind blowing to me. And uh, I mean, just very humble because I feel like. We, we have great Jesus. I mean, uh, he, he's just a really great guy. And he's deserving of that. And uh, everybody's trying to uh, tell him, talk to him as like my little brother. But when re in reality, he, he's his own man. He's really becoming his own self. And I feel when it's all said and done, he's definitely going to be uh, better than I was. Uh, now, nah, this game is all about playing complimentary football. I mean, uh, if our defense gets stopped, we got to get points on the board. And I mean, and we got to put points on the board and, uh, if our defense don't get stopped. So, I mean, just playing complimentary football, everyone working in tandem with each other, just uh, just, just, playing, just playing a totally focused game uh, from special teams, defense and offense, just everyone being on their P's and Q's and uh, going out there ready to play. I mean, uh, we're a tempo team. We've been doing it all season. I mean, if it's not broke, don't fix it. I mean, uh, we've been doing tempo all season, so I mean, why would we change now? Uh, I mean, uh, pre-game, I got to put that young boy on. I got to get the young boy in there. I'm going to uh, young boy, probably get some gun in, and a little baby in there, and, and, and probably finish off with a couple of Meek Mill songs. Uh, and, and definitely right before tip-off, I got to get that, got to get that set it off by Boosie and, not, not two. I, I I have no idea, honestly. I, I have no idea. Nah, my office didn't start rolling into I went to uh, a New Orleans camp. Uh, I think it was the opening. Uh, New Orleans opening, I think it was. I mean, uh... With my college schedule, I really don't get home often. And I mean, when I do go home, I'm a homebody. I really don't go outside much. I probably get a haircut, I get my hair done. But outside of that, I'm in the house playing a game uh, with my little brother, honestly. Travis, speaking of playing a game, what's up, what's up? Uh, you guys are Tigers, LSU's Tigers, Frosted Flakes. Their mascot is a Tiger. I'm going to give you some facts. You tell me which Tiger it is, all right? Pretty easy. I don't have to pick up the time, but I think it's 